Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I'm Shakur Deshay and you're watching a budgeting video. I know it's been so freaking long, but guys, I cannot, I couldn't even think up April if I wanted to. Like all the stuff that happened in April, <laughs> I couldn't make it up if I wanted to. So it is literally May 12th. Happy Mother's Day to all the mothers out there or people who are legal guardians who are women. Thank you for your service. And um, guys, it has been so freaking crazy. Like, I'm going to try to make this video not that long because the next video will be a lot longer because I have maybe like $700 and stuff. And today I may have like a hundred and something maybe like 130 140 to stuff so it shouldn't be that long but oh guys so much has happened and i don't know if i should talk about it in this video or the next video but i guess i'll say it a little bit of it in both so last month guys i had to get my car you guys know every time something happens is with my car i don't know if i know how to put it like it's always something so random but i'm like thank god i have the money that's what uh, that's why i be trying to preach y'all like <laughs> just save because you never know when you're gonna need the money like last month i wasn't really saving like i was supposed to you guys know i wanted to uh save a thousand dollars that did not happen so i don't really i don't even really think i saved anything but i didn't spend my money on like items you know i got stuff that i needed like my car fixed yeah um guys what else happened y'all i went to <laughs> it's it's funny now because i know i feel like something good is coming because when crazy stuff happened i feel like it's like <laughs> the universe trying to prepare you for the good because y'all why i went to open my car door handle <laughs> and it broke It broke y'all this just happened uh this week because today is sunday it happened like monday yeah it happened monday <laughs> i'm laughing because it's so funny because it's like what if all the random things that happened my car door handle to break like y'all i can't make it up like i can't. <laughs> i'm gonna have to get a video and insert so y'all see that i'm not joking like my car handle <laughs> y'all look i'm laughing now because you know i feel like these are all little things to me like you know my car still moves it still gets me to work i still make money in my car that's all that matters like i don't know you just gotta stay positive in this type of um situation should i say but yeah god like y'all i'm gonna just continue to lean on god because everything that has happened so far like in the past months or so i literally it's nothing i can do but lean on god like that's literally all i could do and continue to save <laughs> please continue to save so um yeah we got some uh new things we have a new edition i got a new binder that i'm not going to be stuffing until the next video so i'm not really gonna pull it out now because y'all gonna see it in the next video be sure to watch but this video we are doing our bill binder and our everyday binder so this is now our savings challenge binder so all the challenges i have are going to be in here the ones that we coloring and stuff in our pink binder and then this is my sinking fund binder now our purple binder is it has like envelope that said housing which is really my rent cushion that i'm saving up for it has dream con vacation all of those are sinking funds so it's in this binder now but let's get into this video we can count the money first to see how much we have 20 40 60 80 100 120 121 really 20 40 60 80 100 121 only 121 guys so we have one one and a bunch of 20 so here we are we're gonna do the coins this video because we don't really have a lot to do for this video i think we're only stuffing two so yeah we're just gonna do the coins this video and oh my gosh it's so ooh. 
It's so heavy. Ah. Oh my God, make sure I can get this out of here. Oh my gosh, y'all. Okay, I got it. Oh, I had a few coins in here because I, I didn't want to open this back up again. Oh, look, these are quarters. Look, that add up right there. Okay, let's open this. Now, y'all, look, I can't even, y'all hear that? Can y'all see? It's so full. <laughs> Let me see. Look, y'all, I don't want them to fall out. Oh, my gosh. Oh. That's all of them? Yeah. coming y'all this is so heavy oh my gosh <laughs> we came along like so far and i don't know what the heck i'm gonna put this in afterwards like after i'm done with this because this this should be done this month maybe because it's really it's really full it's not that much love i don't know i have this like bottle that i used to drink out of for like to monitor my water intake but it's like all messed up and stuff Cause I was using it for like random crafts. So I think I might like paint over it and then put these coins in there. Yeah, I think that'll work. So, and another random fact, y'all, the Dollar Tree I got this from, that's by me. Tell me why one of the employees set the Dollar Tree on fire. So it has been closed for like a month and a half now because the freaking employee set the place on fire. Like y'all, when I had saw it had caught on fire, I was like, I know nobody, you know, like how did it catch on fire? Like, was it an electrical thing? I, I refuse to believe that somebody had set it on fire. And then when I found out it was an employee who deliberately set it on fire, oh my gosh. And they were 19, like they were young and it was a girl. And I said, that's so crazy. Like, I forgot what else they put in the story. But it was like, she was mad or something like that. And they ended up putting her, like, on probation. And she got to take anger management classes and stuff like that. And it was like, they lost over a million dollars. And I was like, it's the dollar twenty-five. <laughs> but I had to realize, no, she she's most likely did a lot of damage to the building itself. Because it was like a big building. And y'all, that Dollar Tree haven't even been open for I don't even think it's been open for like three months. It might have just been open for two months. That's so crazy. It was getting so much business too. I loved it. Yeah, so that she ruined it for all of us. But I see them over there every day. They've been working to get it back open and running. But I was like, man, she just really I, I'm rambling, y'all, but that just she really just messed up a whole bunch of people like livelihood that fast. Like all the people that was working there and stuff. You literally out of a job for a while because they're not hiring those people to like clean that stuff up. They have to hire professionals. So yeah, that that's just it. Hopefully people got transferred. I don't I don't know y'all, but hopefully all is well with them. Or they getting like unemployment or something. Cause that's crazy. But okay, let's get to budgeting. Nothing in our mini challenge and nothing goes in here in the next video, but the video I have for like the first week of May, something will go in there. But um, yeah, so technically guys, this is literally like April catch up video. Like everything I didn't stuff in April, that's what this video is. And the next, which is why it's like 700 and something dollars. So I'm so sorry for rambling, but yeah. We do have some uh, changes in this. I separate everything in here now so that it's literally a bill binder. Like my utilities, car insurance, my rent, and subscriptions, and then 90B, my business. And I'm missing one, my phone and my storage. And I'm trying to see, like, okay, guys, when I bought this, it came with, you know, different new labels and stuff. But it didn't have, like, all the ones I needed, so... I'm trying to see how I'm gonna do that. But um, today we are stuffing our our storage and Nundi B, and that's that's literally it, y'all. That's literally it. And my storage went up, y'all. So it went up eight dollars. So now it's eighty one instead of the seventy three I used to pay. I don't want to pay that anymore, but yeah, we, we're gonna work with it for right now. 
And I don't really know what to put it in right now. Like, I really need another. I don't want to put it in utilities because I already. Okay, guys, I am. I'm going to put it in utilities for right now. And then in the next video, I should have another envelope in here to decide, like, for the phone and my storage. And my storage is 81 now. So 20, 40, 60, 80. One right here in utilities. Oops, it's already open. Yeah. So that's 81 in utilities for my storage. And then car insurance is getting nothing. Guys, you would not believe this. That's also what happened. <laughs> Hopefully, I'll just continue to remember as I'm doing these videos all the things that have happened so you guys can like just catch up on my life and stuff. But, um, yeah, we had our insurance renewed this month, so I end up having to like take my check and pay that because, uh, um, our insurance is usually due on the 19th, but our renewal is due on the 10th, so we had to pay that, and that kind of just like threw me off. So nothing is going in insurance and it's already paid. Nothing in rent because I don't really have to pay rent yet. I'm just saving for it, which is why it's in my Seeky Fund binder. And nothing in subscriptions. Um, I do have some coming up, but I still have the money for it on my car. So I think, I don't know, maybe next week I'll stuff it and then when it pays, I'll move it to something else. I don't know. I'm really trying to go crazy on my savings challenges this month. And then Nundi B is last and it's getting $40, which is the last of what we have. Oh, there we go. And now in here is $20, 40 60 80 $100. And honestly, I, I, um, I bought some stuff, but I'm not going to worry about taking it out of here yet because... I rather just continue to build this. I end up making some soap and I'm so happy with how it came out. I need to make some more. But um yeah, so hopefully by what is this? It's Mother's Day. When is Father's Day? Maybe by Father's Day I'll be able to open my site back up. I'm not sure. I know before DreamCon though, I want my site to be open back up before DreamCon. But I have to include like cure time for my soaps. And then we're going to open this. We don't have anything to stuff in here. But um, I know you guys are probably like, you didn't put nothing in gas. I think I got a few dollars in here. And I'll probably put some more in here um, when I actually budget May week one. I'm sorry. When I actually budget May week one money, I'll put some in here. I'm going to take it here. One, <laughs> one two, three, four, five, six. 8, 9, 10. That's 10. Okay, so that's $10 in here. And then we have ties, and I need to pay this. I think I'm going to end up paying it online and then moving this money into my, like, cash to stuff. I'm sorry. Toiletries has nothing... I don't know if it had anything the last time I uh showed y'all, but I ended up getting like some stuff for the house. I got some toothpaste, some like scent beads to wash and stuff. And then groceries is getting nothing and shopping is getting nothing. But um, thanks so much for tuning into this video, listening to me ramble, guys. It has been a crazy week, but you guys have been nonstop supporting me. Like, the past month has been crazy with views, with subscribers. I am so thankful for you all. I'm going to go and reply some more. And, like, my cruise vlog, I did not think it would do that many views. Like, it hit 2K views. That is a lot for me. So, I did edit my uh, next upload for the cruise vlog, which <laughs> is long overdue. I'm so sorry. I just, I did not expect that. I also didn't expect the month I had. And it's just, you know, sometimes you got to stay motivated because I don't know. You just got to stay motivated. <laughs> but anyway, um, thanks so much for tuning into this video. I will see you guys in the next video.